It's Christmas time, my favorite time of the year! Merry Christmas, everyone! <laughs> I can hardly wait to see what Santa Claus will bring me this year. <laughs> oh, well, I don't know about Santa, but you can sure count on me bringing you a delicious Christmas dinner. It couldn't be any worse than that Thanksgiving turkey you burned up. La 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 la. Here we go again. It's that time of year when my mom and dad start acting like a couple of little kids. What's so bad about that? It is Christmas. That's right. And Christmas is the time for fun, so I suggest you start having some. Whatever. Now don't be such a Scrooge. You guys need to dress up too and get into the holiday spirit. What do you expect us to do? Put on reindeer antlers or something? No. Oh. Hi, Zoe. Merry Christmas. Oh, what an adorable little Christmas outfit. See, now that's what I'm talking about. Hey, that gives me an idea. Why not have the whole family dress up for the holidays? Yeah. Yes, that's the spirit. We'll have ourselves a Christmas holiday costume party. Holiday, holiday party! party! It looks like I'll be wearing those reindeer antlers after all. Well, I guess I'd better be going. Ugh. If I have to do this, you're in too. Uh. Dinosaur King is what you wanna be, yeah. Make your money, make your money. Dinosaur King is your destiny, yeah. Make your money, make your money. Control the cards right in your hands. Jurassic Giants at your command. D-D-D-D team. Watch out, here we go. Prehistoric dinosaurs aren't extinct anymore. See them fight, hear a roar. Watch out, cause they're right next door. The past is in the present. Times been twisted upside down. These fossils are colossal. Only one can wear the crown. Dinosaur King is what you wanna be, yeah. Dinosaur King is your destiny, yeah. Have a good time, kids. We'll see you both tonight. Okay, see you later. Goodbye, Bye, kids. Come on, Laura. Okay. Bye, Mommy and Daddy. You two behave yourselves at Grandpa's. Have a good time, kids. We'll see you both tonight. Okay, see you later. Goodbye, kids. <laughs> No skipping of meals in this household of mine. For dinner, dinner? we have motor oil stew. <laughs> Aren't you going to do something about Helga? Even if we survive her throwing us around, she's going to kill us with her cooking, yes? Nonsense. She may have had a few blown fuses and some crossed wires, but she's harmless. Now she's going after the produce! Yesterday, I saw her head spin completely around. Helga may have taken a few too many volts to the brain, but she's a devoted servant and she'd never hurt us. Isn't that right, Helga? Who are you? Helga! I'm the one who first jump-started your heart! And who are you, kid? Your boss. Get back to the kitchen and make chocolate cake. Yes, boss! And I'm a 21-year-old supermodel who would like something low-carb. And I'm her nutritionist. President of the United States! Here's something low-carb, Ursula! Here's some nutrition for you, Zander! And you, Ed, couldn't be in charge of tying your shoes! Well, apparently, we're very memorable. <sighs> hmm? Are you kids hungry? Mm, well, actually, we were wondering about Christmas. It's probably no use. Mm, never mind, Grandpa. I know what you two really want. You want to go out on another mission, don't you? A mission? I need someone to get all the dinosaur cards back from that wretched D-team, and a couple of kids would be the perfect undercover agents to send, right? That's right. Ed and Xander and I are just the undercover kids that you need. A cute young girl and her two little friends. You can forget it! You three had your chances and messed up every time! Laura and Rod, you go and take Terry and Tank with you, okay? Thanks, Grandpa. You can count on us. Look at all the snow. It sure feels like Christmas here, doesn't it? Wow, look at that great big Santa down there. Big deal, it's just a fake statue. Mom, where'd all the 
these costumes come from? They're from my college days. I used to be in the theater department. Now I'm glad I kept them all. Hey, how about something like this, honey? Ooh, it's a Robin Hood outfit. I used to pretend I was Robin Hood all the time when I was a boy. This one is all mine. This one here is for Max. And look at this, Rex. This is perfect. Are you really going to make us wear these things? I don't know. I think I'll pass. No way. It's only for Christmas Eve, boys. Uh. Fine, but how come I have to be the snowman? Excuse me, ma'am, but which way to Sherwood Forest? What a handsome Robin Hood. Beware, ne'er-do-well! You're having so much fun. <sighs> we'll put a stop to that. Huh? As soon as they leave the house, we'll break in and steal back the dinosaur cards. Sort of like Santa Claus in reverse. Oh, wow, well, it's time for me to go pick up the Christmas cake. I got it from the best bakery in town. You have to put your order in a month ahead of time. Capture Max's mom? No, we're not gonna capture her. We're just gonna distract her, and then you have to try and keep her from going back home for a little while. Then I'll lure Max and the others out of the house and sneak back in and get the cards. Yeah, but... What's the matter with you, Laura? All we're doing is getting back the dinosaur cards that Grandpa and Dr. Ancient created and returning them to where they belong. Yeah, but it feels wrong. So I guess you're saying you don't want to go back to Mom and Dad? No, of course I do. I want that more than anything. Then let's do what we have to do. Come on, there she is now. Take my cake! Come back with that box! Oh, this is terrible. Lose something. Oh, there you are. If you want your stupid cake back, you'll have to come over here and get it. My, my. Wow, you must want cake pretty badly to act this way. Uh, well, that's not... You've probably heard how delicious that bakery's cakes are, and when you saw it, you couldn't help yourself. I barely got one myself, even though I put the order in a whole month ago. So I can't blame you for wanting one, too. Yeah, I guess so. I have an idea. Come home with me, and you can share it with my family. Well, yeah, I guess that's okay. So you're Rod, and you're Laura, right? Right. Do you know what, kids? I have a son named Max who's just about your age. And his friend Rex lives with us, too. And there's Max's other friend Zoe who's spending the day with us. And my husband and I know they'll be delighted to have you two join our Christmas party. It'll be a big crowd, but the more the merrier, right? This is too good to be true. We're going to walk right into the house with her. But what about your family, children? Won't they have their own plans for Christmas Eve and wonder where you are? No, our parents are uh, on a trip and, uh... Yeah, so we're on our own. Really? Oh, well, all the more reason for you to come have fun with us. So I invited them to join our party. Isn't that great? And Max, I knew you'd be the most excited of all. Thanks so much for inviting us. I hope we're not getting in the way or anything. You sure look like you know how to celebrate a holiday the right way. All of your costumes are really cool. Yeah, but you're a... I mean... Come on now, everybody. It's Christmas Eve, a time for fun and family and a chance for even the worst of enemies to bury the hatchet. The worst of enemies? No, it's just a figure of speech. Max, I believe your father's talking about the way you always get into fights around here with Rex and Zoe. Well, I'll have none of that with Rod and Laura here. Do you understand? Uh, well... Yeah. Now that's a good little snowman. I think I smell dinner burning. Oh, that's right! We've got a delicious Christmas roast coming! Could you give me a hand, honey? Robin Hood at your service! <laughs> that's a good little snowman. What are you two doing here? Uh-uh-uh! Don't forget, your mother just said you're not supposed to fight with us! So what do you think they're up to? I'm sure they came here to try and get the dinosaur cards. I bet you're right, especially since the card we got in Kyoto was the last one of the 36 types, so there won't be any more new ones to get. Hey, where do you think you're going? <laughs> You can't just go snooping around our house. It won't take long, it's so little. Hey! I'll bet your mother doesn't know these so-called pets of yours are really dinosaurs, does she? No. She might not like it if she found out that these little guys get really big and battle with other dinosaurs and that you've been hiding it. Is that a threat? No, it's our plan. <laughs> oh no! Cut it out! You too, stop it! What's all the racket up there? Nothing, Mom, everything's fine. Now's our chance to look for those cards. They've got to be here somewhere. What do you think you're doing in my bedroom? 
Get out of here! They're not in here. Not here either. I mean it! <laughs> Stop it now, all of you! Verk, Verk, Verk! So many messes to clean! My poor books. Huh? Well, look at that! It's my dear old Megalosaurus. Forgot all about you. I had high hopes for this one, but he was just too violent. He meant well, but played too rough. And once he became an adult, well, he was uncontrollable. You bad boy. You're going up on the shelf for a while to think about all the things you've done. And the timing for this one couldn't be more perfect. <laughs> Sorry, Rod and Laura. I warned Max, but apparently he doesn't listen well. But it wasn't my fault! <gasps> I see that the two of you each have strange-looking doggies, too. Isn't that a coincidence? Yeah, it sure is. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Here you go, Rod. All fixed. I'm sorry about this. Thank you. It looks good as new now. Aki, don't you think we ought to get this party started? Absolutely. Let's eat. Come on, kids. Time for a Christmas feast. Have your cake and hit the road. Dr. Z, the Alpha Droid Scout we sent out is beaming back pictures from the house of that D-team. Hmm? Searching. <laughs> <laughs> what in the name of dinosaurs are they doing? Well, it looks to me like they're having a party. Yes, a celebration with food and presents and a Christmas tree and everything. Helpful as that was, Xander. When I need a definition of a party, I'll ask for it. Oh, no, it looks like Rod and Laura may have gotten caught sneaking in. And they're being forced to eat cake? Uh, well, I don't know. I guess this kind of thing is what happens when you send children out on a grown-up's mission. Then I'll give you three clods one more chance to go fix it! Huh? Take this! Wow, so where did this one come from? I thought you didn't have any cards left. You want it or not? Yes, yes, I'm sure this will come in handy. No, no more homework, no more stew, no more Helga's nasty food. You three just better bring those cards and my grandkids back here safe and sound. Count on us! <laughs> this has to be the most delicious cake I've ever had. What do you kids think? It's really good. Yeah. I love it. I'm glad you like it. How about a third piece for Robin Hood, Fair Maiden? Careful. You might turn into Friar Tuck. You children can have as many pieces as you want, though. Thanks, but I'm pretty full. Huh? Mm. It's okay. Don't be shy. Well, then, if it's okay with you, I'd like to stay here a little while longer. Of course, children. Just make yourselves at home. All right with you? Uh, well, I guess. No, oh, I almost got you. If you're lucky, I don't have... about them. Dr. Owen has raised me like his own son ever since. Hmm. Huh. Ho, ho, ho! Come on in, kids. Robin Claus and his wife are here with Christmas presents for everyone. Wow! Right. Thanks, Mom and Dad. This is great. I can't wait to open it. Here you go. Huh? Huh? Merry Christmas, kids. It was kind of last minute, so it's nothing too fancy. <laughs> They're books with Aki's drawings, and she's pretty good. It's not much, but I hope you enjoy them. This is amazing. Thank you both so much. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. I have a picture of Ace in mine. And I have pictures of Paris. Thank you, Mr. and Mrs. Taylor. Wow. <sighs> Hey, so what's the big idea of giving me a dumb old math book? You got that extra book because your math grades aren't so great, Max, and we thought you could do some studying over winter break. What? That really stinks! Oh! Uh. Oh. Huh? <gasps> Come here, Max. What's wrong with you? Apologize to your mom! Let go of me, you creep! Your mom and dad gave you something to help you with school because they care about you. Don't you 
you understand that? Oh, yeah? Like, I really need to hear a lecture from some Christmas Eve party crasher like you. Hmm? No one wants you here, so why don't you just get out? Oh, Max. Laura, it's time for us to go. Thank you so much for everything. Not You're at all, welcome. kids. welcome. Max, I'm appalled you would treat anyone so rudely. You don't understand. Hey, that's strange. My dino holder was right there, but now it's gone. Ugh, Rod and Laura stole it! <laughs> that worked out well. Yeah, and I think when he sees this, Grandpa will finally repair the time machine for us. Then we'll finally get to go back home to see Mom and Dad again. Yup. Hold it, you two! Give me back my dino holder, you thieving thieves! Here they come, Rod. I guess they want to play. Alpha Slash! <gasps> dino Slash! Go, Triceratops! Roar! Dino Slash! Carnotaurus, blow them away! We can't lose this one! We have to win so we can get back home! Claws and his reindeer chomp. All right, Ace, let's send him home for the holidays. Mayfly! Huh? You hoo huh? The A team is here now, so we'll take care of this. Oh no, it's the old lady. How dare you call me that? If I weren't so full of Christmas cheer and goodwill, I'd stuff you up the chimney. Just use the card! Oh yeah, I almost forgot. We brought a Christmas present for you. I've never seen him before. A Megalosaurus! Look at all the colors! This must be another secret dinosaur. on the reckless side. Uh, do you think he realizes we're all on the same team? I'm not gonna be the one to tell him. No, hey! What's going on? He's using zero G throw! No way! Don't worry, Chomp will get him. Thunder Bazooka! was a close one, but at least we won. The card! Yeah. Another dinosaur card for our collection. Awesome! And I even got Zoe's dino holder back, too. Huh? Really? You wanted those books more than the dinosaur card? Huh. We'll be back to get those cards next time. <laughs> And if you tell Dr. Z we didn't get the cards, Sandra, if you tell him we didn't bring back Megalosaurus! What about you? I'll tell him I didn't have anything to do with it! There they go. I hope you made up with them after being so unkind. Yeah, I think they're okay. That's good. They were nice kids. Mom and Dad, I'm sorry for what I said. I'll do the math workbook, I guess. At least, I'll try. I suppose that's all we can ask. What do you say we all head back to the house and get this party going again? Yeah, after all, it's still Christmas Eve. All this excitement made me kind of hungry, Aki. Is there more?
left? Not for you. You boys had your share. Zoe and I get the rest. Right, Zoe? Right! Come on, Robin Hood. Aren't you supposed to steal stuff, like cake, and give it to us poor guys? Not when it's your mom. No. Now with this Megalosaurus card we just got, we've collected 31 different types of cards so far. Keep watching, because we're going to keep collecting more. <laughs>